down here, salt is a way of life. Obviously, the environment down here is all salt. The, the ceiling's salt, the floor's salt, the walls are salt, and to an extent, the air is salt. Hi, this is Abel 1975 and welcome to Elite Dangerous on the Xbox. And today, I've got Salt Seam Part 5. I know, Part 5, it's incredible. If you've missed any, don't worry, there's a playlist. If you go to my playlist section, there's a Lyra playlist, and you can watch all the episodes combined. Uh, it's getting quite long now. <laughs> We're five episodes deep. Um, this episode is really starring the pirate orc, the snake himself, uh, with wonderful footage from Ruud, also provided by Scooby, and of course the salt provided by Yo Eminence. Now, I have been on nights for the last few days, and um, so I've missed out on a lot of what's been going on, an awful lot of what's been going on. Discord has been alive with stuff going on. Masses and masses of stuff going on all throughout the evenings and into the days. And I've been getting home bleary-eyed in the morning, clicking on Discord and catching up. So I was quite surprised to see a whole host of screenshots and uh, people basically saying this. I hear you're a racist now, Father. <laughs> to say I was shocked is a complete understatement. Um, being someone of mixed race, I find it really, really hilarious that someone was comparing me to being a Nazi and making comments about racism and Elite Dangerous. To be honest, calling someone of mixed race a Nazi propagandist is racism. So be very careful with that. The reason why we still have racism in life and in games is because there are too many ignorant people out there. Um, so don't display your own ignorance by accusing someone of being a Nazi. Um, it's absolutely insane. Just crazy. Um, yeah. I don't think the Nazis would have liked me. I'm mixed race and my other half is of Jewish extraction. Um, added to that, I'm registered disabled. So they would have killed me on sight for three things straight away. So no, um, I found it quite shocking, but let's keep it light. It was also quite funny. And I've always admitted being a propagandist, I am the propaganda channel for the Dark Marauders. I actually, my rank in the Dark Marauders as political officer is a bit of a joke. And I generally make videos about what happens to me and the Dark Marauders in game. So yeah, from a Dark Marauders point of view. So I'm of course going to be biased and propaganda for the Dark Marauders. Now, he also claimed that this line here was my, was evidence that I cheat or proof that I cheated. Um, now, all I said was blocking people can cause connection issues. I was referring to instancing issues as well as wider issues in trying to get people together. It's a real nightmare if you've ever been in a fight with someone who's got you blocked. Um, now, yeah, he says this is me saying that I cheat. It's not. It's me saying there's an issue if you block people. They can't instance with you. Um, I'm sorry if he mistook that as some sort of threat, but it definitely wasn't. I was only talking about instancing and connection uh, in game. And I'll be honest, if he wants to go out and prove that blocking people doesn't have any effect, good luck with that. Try reading system chat of what the blocked person's saying to you, and also try and drop on their wake or get into a fight that a blocked person's in. Good luck. I'd love to see your results. Maybe stream it on your live stream. Now, Obviously, the, the boys have been out hunting Lyra. They've got many kills on Lyra. Um, one of our friends, Papa Prometheus, is paying a hefty bounty on Lyra kills. So I'm going to let other people bring you the montage of Lyra kills. I'm using the footage of a combat log from two points of view um, and reporting on other stuff that happened. So Yermanen's had a dispute with the Hands Discord. Um, I don't think he gets that the Hands Discord is supposedly a PvP forum for people to get together and bring the community closer together. He thinks it's making Elite Dangerous a bad place. I don't think that's going to go down well with the PvPers that frequent the Hands Discord. Um, from what I've seen, they didn't take too kindly to that. Uh, the meme game has been on point, as well as those two great memes from earlier. This was my favourite of the week, and I've got to give Attack Panda full credit for this one. It was a brilliant use of a meme. And overall, it's been a fun, interesting experience this week now as i said i am a propaganda channel i do make propaganda videos for the dark marauders i've never ever said i don't um, however i do like to support anything i say with evidence uh, the reason i do this because i like to be fact-based your eminence prefers to go a different route more the conspiratorial or 
some would say, deranged route. Now he made claims that Pirate Orc logged and um, when he was asked for video evidence he said he didn't need any video evidence uh, which obviously made the community go especially when the other person involved actually turned around and said no they meant Orc went offline uh, not combat logged they weren't actually in combat uh, they couldn't there was some hoo-ha about them meeting up for Desiat for a 1v1 and uh, he claimed Orc logged out of the game that's a little bit different to a combat lock. Now, he also may claim that the footage that you're watching has been edited together. Now, I have used Scooby's clip as background and I've cut it up into sections, but I've left the time codes in and it's available on Scooby's Xbox DVR. But I've left Alt's clip as one clip, straight from his Xbox DVR with no embellishment, no editing, no nothing. Because that's proof of a combat lock. Now, Yeoman and me do have some common ground. Neither of us like Spear. So there we go. Nice to know I have some common ground with my adversary. And, you know, it is nice to see that he can be right about one thing. That makes a refreshing change. What? Now, I would like to extend an olive branch to your eminence and say, if you have any issues with these videos or any issue with any of my content, if you feel that any of my content is racist or abusive or horrible, then please just contact me. I'm always willing to talk. In fact, I'd love to have you on and do a discussion with you on why you think that piracy by a member of the Dark Marauders warrants you declaring war on us. Um, why, as a faction, we should be wiped out because we pirate people in PvP. Uh, we've always been a pirate faction. There are some salty care bears out there that consider us to be the same as griefers but we always consider ourselves to be role play pirates now i'd be happy to have you uh, be on your live stream or have you on the channel and have a nice honest discussion um i can honestly say we are not cheaters i built this channel on reporting cheats and honestly i don't know any dark marauder member that has cheated ever in my time in the dark marauders and if any one of them did and I found out about it, I would make a video and expose them because my channel was built on exposing cheats. And as for this video, well, this is a menu log. The guy still takes damage towards the end and it vanishes. As I would say, this is a 15 second time a menu log. Um, you know, one of those things. It's not technically cheating, but my God, is it frowned upon in the PvP community. Uh, not a good move, not a shrewd move. Definitely something that's going to make you stand out in the future. Uh, but. You know, that's why you need video evidence, because you can review it then and see what actually, actually happened. And that makes a huge difference. You really need that video evidence of stuff if you're going to make claims. But anyway, one of the funniest things that happened is after he made this claim, uh, Pirate Orc did reveal himself to be Crusader in uh, Lyra's uh, Discord, and he's been in their squadron for a while. And um, yeah. The pirate orc revealing his snaky move before he slivered off to claim another victim. Anyway, that's all for this video. Thank you very much for watching. I'll catch you in the next one. And uh, 07 to everyone, especially your eminence.